Amen. Well, praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord. This is me, Apostle Esther. I want to thank you for joining me today for my YouTube channel. Thank you to all of my new subscribers. Thank you so much to my new viewers and to all of you that are sharing and liking my content. I appreciate that so, so, so very much. Uh, we're excited about sharing in the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ. Um, I am here to encourage, to inspire, and to motivate you. And um, just reflecting on our service from this morning, um, we are doing Zoom now, um, and we just had a wonderful fellowship. So I want to pull back from some of the passages that we shared, and I want to share them with you on this week. And I pray that the word of the Lord will bless you. I am going to give you an opportunity to get your Bibles, to get your notepads, to get your iPads, your devices, and you can follow along with me. We're going to be going to Mark um, chapter 11, verses 22 through 24. I'm going to give you a moment to grab that. More than anything, grab the word of God. We'll be right back. God bless you. Okay, so we're back. Mark chapter 11, verses 22 down to 24. I'm going to read out of the King James translation and then we're going to skip right over to the new king james uh, translation as well so the bible reads and jesus answering saith unto them have faith in god for verily i say unto you that whosoever shall say unto this mountain be thou removed and be thou cast into the sea but be thou cast into the sea and shall not doubt in his heart but shall believe that those things which he saith shall come to pass, he shall have whatsoever he saith. Therefore I say unto you, what things soever you desire when you pray, believe that you receive them and ye shall have them. And the new King James translation says, and Jesus answered and said unto them, have faith in God. For assuredly I say to you, Whoever says to this mountain, be thou removed and be cast into the sea and does not doubt in his heart, but believe, believes that those things he says will be done. He shall have whatever he says. Verse 24. Therefore, I say unto you, whatever things you ask when you pray, believe that you receive them and you will have them. I want to encourage you today to have faith in God or have the God kind of faith. The Bible says that whosoever that shall ask whatsoever shall have whatever he says. So I want to encourage you today that the authority of God, the, the authority of the word is in your mouth. You need to begin to, de to declare and to decree, to decree what the word of the Lord says. Whatsoever we ask in his name, it shall be given unto us. So when we pray, we must believe. If you believe, then you will receive. There is authority in your mouth. I am Apostle Esther. I pray that this word has blessed you, that it has encouraged you, and it has inspired you on today. Believe what the word of the Lord says. As always, have an amazing day. Thank you for sharing and liking the content. Again, I am releasing every day, Monday through Friday for, um, at 10 a.m. So as, I ask that you listen out for that notification bell. As always, have an amazing day. We'll see you on tomorrow. God bless you.